Hello and welcome to this video on machine guarding. In this video, we'll discuss what machine guarding is, why it's important, and the different types of machine safety guards available. In industrial settings, machines are used to make our lives easier and more efficient. However, these machines can be dangerous if proper precautions are not taken. That's where machine safety guards come in. What is machine guarding? Machine guarding refers to physical barriers or shields that are placed around dangerous machines to protect workers from harm. These guards prevent employees from coming into contact with hazardous machine parts, such as moving belts, gears, and blades. Machine guards are typically made from materials such as metal, plastic, or wire mesh, and can be designed to fit specific machines or applications. Why is machine guarding important? Machine guarding is crucial for ensuring worker safety in industrial settings. According to the Occupational Safety and Health Administration, OSHA, lack of proper machine guarding is one of the top 10 most frequently cited OSHA violations. Accidents involving machinery can result in severe injuries or even death, so it's essential to take precautions to prevent them. The importance of machine guarding are 1. Prevents workers from coming in contact with hazardous machine parts, reducing the risk of injury and death. 2. Reduces the likelihood of damage to the machine itself, leading to decreased maintenance costs and downtime. 3. Complies with OSHA regulations, avoiding fines and legal liabilities for the company. 4. Increases employee confidence and productivity, as workers feel safer and more secure on the job. 5. Demonstrates the company's commitment to safety, improving its reputation and attracting top talent. Let us understand the various type of machine guards. Fixed guards. These are permanent guards that are securely attached to the machine and cannot be removed without the use of tools. They provide a physical barrier that prevents employees from accessing hazardous machine parts. Adjustable guards. Adjustable guards, like fixed guards, are permanent but they can be adjusted to allow the machine to handle different sizes of material. They must be manually adjusted and locked into place, so all employees who will operate adjustable guards must be trained on their use. If improperly adjusted or locked, adjustable guards can fail to prevent contact with moving parts, causing serious or even fatal injury. Self-adjusting guards Self-adjusting guards serve the same purpose as adjustable guards, but automatically adapt to the size of the material. When the machine is at rest, these guards sit all the way down. When the machine is in use, the operator feeds material into the machine, which opens the guard just enough to let the material in. These guards are commonly found on table saws and woodworking tools. Interlocking guards Interlocking guards, also known as barrier guards, automatically shut off or disengage the power source when the guard is open or removed. These are particularly useful in situations where operators need to be able to open the guard or access the guarded parts of the machine, such as when clearing jams. These guards allow safe access to interior parts of the machine without requiring a total disassembly. However, they can be easy to open on accident and require careful adjustment and maintenance. Here are 10 tips for safe machine guarding. 1. Identify all potential hazards and assess the risk associated with them before installing machine guards. 2. Choose the appropriate type of guard for the machine and the specific hazard it poses. 3. Make sure the machine guard is securely attached and cannot be easily removed or bypassed. 4. Regularly inspect and maintain machine guards to ensure they are functioning properly. 5. Train employees on the importance of machine guarding and how to use the guards effectively. 6. Ensure that guards do not interfere with the normal operation of the machine or impede production. 7. Provide clear instructions and guidelines for removing and replacing guards for maintenance or repairs. 8. Use interlocking guards that prevent the machine from starting if the guard is not in place. 9. Consider adding additional safety features such as warning signs, lights, or alarms to alert employees to potential hazards. 10. Regularly review and update machine guarding procedures and policies to ensure they are effective and up-to-date with the latest safety standards. In conclusion, 
Machine safety guarding is an essential aspect of industrial safety. By installing proper guards on machines, workers can be protected from dangerous moving parts, and accidents can be prevented. Remember, machine guarding is not optional, it's mandatory for all industrial settings. Thank you for watching, and stay safe.